One of the really interesting aspects of this debate over the Trans Mountain Pipeline deal this week is how Jason Kenney is saying it's the incompetence of Rachel Notley in Alberta and Justin Trudeau in Ottawa that led to the crisis this week that forced the federal government to step in and buy the whole pipeline project for four and a half billion dollars. And of course, Jason Kenney supporters are saying that if he had been premier, this pipeline would have gone ahead, that Kenney is a much better leader than Rachel Notley. But look back to 2016 when Trudeau gave his blessing and he approved the pipeline. He said it was because of Rachel Notley's work on the environmental front. And he was praising her, saying that her climate leadership plan that included the carbon tax was the reason he had given conditional approval for this project. So you got to think, of course, Kenny is against the carbon tax. He will scrap the climate leadership plan. He's against the pan-Canadian plan. He's against the federal carbon tax. So you got to think, if he had been premier three years ago, Trudeau would not have approved the Trans Mountain Pipeline deal and there'd be no deal to fight over. So Kenny can criticize, of course, the governments in Ottawa and here in Edmonton over what actually happened this week with the deal. But keep in mind, if he had been premier, odds are there would have been no deal and no project to fight over. I'm Graham Thompson with the Edmonton Journal.